Welcome to Dependable Flame, where we explore vintage petrol lighters, ashtrays, tobacchiana, and other useful mechanisms. Make yourself at home. Today we have a really cool old aluminum block petrol lighter. This one manufactured by Del Mar. It says patent applied for. You can see that that screwdriver slot has been marred up just a bit. This lighter has a really nice knurled fuel screw which does have an integrated standard precision screwdriver by which you can manipulate the flint spring screw tighten that up, loosen it, whatever it is that you may need to do with it. Little short screwdriver. It's a little bit difficult to manipulate. There you can see the wadding and the terminal end of the wick threads all looks just as it should very robustly threaded fuel screw which does its job and it is a little bit oversized fits kind of sticks out over the edge on both sides a little bit not typical. The roller also a little bit short because it's on a short lighter but it's a really fat one so it kind of sticks out there a little bit more than you would typically see a roller sticking out from the body of a lighter. There is a sort of high polish finish to this aluminum lighter does show scuffs, scratches, wear, carbon buildup, other grime. See some marks here on the bottom of the snuffer where it has interacted with that piston, which is the type of spring that keeps that down or in the up position. It's a very diminutive lighter, although it is pretty thick and pretty wide for how short it is. It's a really cool old lighter that if you are an aluminum block petrol lighter collector, you definitely should have this in your collection. We have had no shortage of aluminum block petrol lighters recently. Purchased uh, two different lots from one seller. And then, well that was probably a couple of months ago. And then this last month, made another purchase in a secondary online auction site where we ended up, I think we bought four different lots from that auction and some of those were aluminum block lighters as well. Seems to light very well with this Dunhill blue flint in it. It worked pretty well without it but not exactly what I would call reliable. It is very important here at DependableFlame.com that our lighters work and that they work reliably. Hence the name. So when you buy a lighter from us and you go to strike it up, it should be dependable. It should be reliable. You should not be striking and wearing your hands out and 
dealing with the absence of a flame. When you strike the lighter, it should light. And this one is doing a pretty good job of that right now. You can see the scratches and other wear. Scuffs. Overall though, it's in really good condition. Really good functioning condition and its aesthetic appeal is pretty good as well, I think. Especially, like we mentioned, when you consider some of the nuances of this lighter that are a little bit different from others. That big old roller that's just sitting there on the corner of the lighter. This little short, squat, and fat roller lighter. I know a lot of people like to call these lift arms. I think it is more appropriate on an aluminum block roller lighter that the snuffer is called a snuffer, not a lift arm. Lift arm is more appropriate, I believe, for the Dunhill type, Golden Wheel, all those, where it is literally a, an arm that is being raised, therefore a lift arm, uh, not a lift snuffer. <laughs> I'm sure some of you will disagree with me on that. That's just my own personal preference. But again, just like you have proper names for certain things, fuel caps, file rollers, sometimes called flint wheels, there are all kinds of different names for many of these parts. I just happen to think that that lift arm name is one that is probably better held for fewer lighters than applied to the masses of lighters. And like I said, I just don't think that it applies to a roller lighter period because it's not a lift arm. The whole thing sits there looking like a block or a rectangle, a squared off shape. So again, lift arm just doesn't apply in my thinking. But no matter what you call it, whether you call it a snuffer, a lift arm, whether you call it a file wheel or flint wheel or file roller, may have trouble understanding what you're talking about with other collectors, but nobody's going to have a hard time understanding what you're saying about the function of the lighter. Until next time.